For a few fleeting moments, it's quiet. I can't believe they're still sleeping. Call it the calm before the storm, a brief break for Jessica Plored before her husband goes to work. Love you. And then the day is divided by four. There's seven-year-old Madison and newborn triplets Alex, Asher, and Jackson. Does it ever stop? No. <laughs> no, it doesn't. Since the boys were born, it's been an endless cycle of comforting, changing, cleaning. You don't um, have time to eat? No, not really. Which is when the meal train comes into play is so unbelievably helpful. Hi, Jess. Tonight, chicken and a side of salad prepared and delivered by a neighbor. How are you? All organized by her best friend, Aurora Milve, on the social calendar-based website, Meal Train. Once it was up and running, it pretty much runs itself. Put the address where the meals should be dropped off. Meal Train creator Michael Laramie says the website brings friends and family together to support someone in need, typically after a diagnosis, deployment, or new baby. Thank you. It's one of several online services that allows you to create a profile and invite others to sign up for a date to pitch in with a homemade dish. To be able to create something that helps so many people yeah. is, is such a joy. Laramie now estimates about 2 million people in 40 different countries use Meal Train each month. This is kind of nice, and we can just sit here and eat breakfast. A modern way to make life that much easier when times get tough. You'll be next. It's just the sense of community is incredible. We've had people we don't even know sign up to bring us meals. <laughs> Simple acts of kindness served through a warm meal. Steve Patterson, NBC News, Stores, Connecticut. Hey, NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.